For this effortlessly chic and timeless red lip look, first of all I'll be highlighting the skin using La Lumiere highlighter with the powder brush. With the beautiful Georgia, I start by sweeping the highlighter across the top of her cheekbones. You can also take the highlighter through the temples and anywhere that you want to add that beautiful high shine. I love radiant luminous skin as the perfect backdrop to the red lip. Next I'm using La Terre Bronzer to gently contour Georgia's skin. Starting underneath the cheekbones in sweeping motions, the brush is perfect for giving that sheer bronze effect. You can also bronze along the jawline, through the temples, and anywhere that you want to add that sun-kissed effect. Next I'm adding a soft sheen to the lid using Le Ombre Eyeshadow in Sultan. For this look I prefer to work in light layers. Sweep the eyeshadow brush into the eyeshadow and move backwards and forwards across your lid until you have a beautiful high shine. I really adore this quad because it has four complementary tones of eyeshadow which really help you to intensify the colour if needed or like Georgia today you can wear the eyes in a soft subtle sheen. Using the lighter shade in the quad I'm going to highlight the inner corner of the eye. Next to define the eyebrows, I'm using Le Sourcil Pencil in shade Blonde. Starting on the inner corner of the eyebrows, I'm using sweeping motions to mimic brow hair. You can also use the pencil on the flat side to fill in any gaps and create that perfect arch. This pencil formula glides through the brows, making definition easy. I soften the brows by grooming through with the eyebrow brush. To set the brows, I'm using Le Serum Sourcil. This gently lifts and separates the brows, holding them in place all day long. Next, I move on to the lashes using Le Serum Noir Mascara. This beautiful formula fans and separates the lashes whilst adding just the right amount of volume. I like to gently move the mascara wand backwards and forwards to ensure the mascara gets right to the root of the lashes, giving you the ultimate lift. Okay, let's move on to the ultimate red lip, starting with lip pencil in rouge. Personally, I like to start with the Cupid's bow as I find it adds balance to the lip. Using light feathering strokes, define the outer edge of your lip line, both top and bottom. Feel free to add a little bit of pencil onto the body of your lip to add a base. Now it's time for the stunning shade Rouge Rosy. This rich toned red is full of pigment with a creamy texture, making it suitable for all skin tones. You can choose to either apply straight from the bullet or use the lip brush like I am for a sharper edge. When using a lip brush to apply a red lip, you can use your lip line as a guide. Here I'm tracing the outer edge of the lip with the brush and then sweeping the lipstick onto the body of the lip. Start at the corner of the mouth and draw your brush upwards. This will give you a precise line and a full lip. And here's the final look, the beautiful Georgia wearing lipstick Rouge Rosie, the perfect red.